So some of you may already know, but we're going to be using A-frames for all the eye lines this year and a specific type of A-frame called the hang frame. And it's designed like this with two plates that come down to a bolt, which we will call the hang bolt. And our lines are connected to this hang bolt uh, with two delta quick links for, the, for most of the lines or two oval quick links for some of the lines. Um, and what, the way we're going to do it is we're going to set up a B of K with all the bolts in the system, as I have here, with the included uh, dynamic rope that's in each anchor kit. And the BFK is going to be with a figure eight knot. We want to stick with figure eights throughout the festival because they're the most inspectable knot and the most recognizable for beginners. And that includes the connection of the rope ends as well. Figure eights there. No fishermen's or anything fancy. Just so beginners can look at it and know what's going on. And so the way you want to do that is keep the, the loop at the end of your BFK very small. Small as you can. Smaller the better to prevent uh, anything sliding down um, while the line is rigged. But um, yeah, so you want to connect two opposing delta quick links to your, mas to your BFK master point there and put the wide end in on the ropes. And then you can connect it to the bolt by opening up the hang frame and put it in between these two wooden spacers here, the pointy end of the delta quick links, right on the bolt there. And then once that's good to go, you can connect your, your main web lock here and your backup web lock there and just rig straight off of there. And this is a good point to, to use for, for hauling tag lines as well. That would be nice and set. And also, these hang frames have these nice um, eye bolts and nuts on the feet. And so the, the, the eye nut, which is oriented horizontally, will be facing forward. And that's going to go to the stabilizer that stabilizer bolt that's in front of the hang frame. And most of the hang frames are going to have the crossbar on the opposite side of this one. This is done incorrectly. The crossbar is to be in the back towards the anchor. And that's for safety reasons. And then the, the back part of the high bolt is going to have another set of ratchet straps going to the outside most bolts, both sides. And those can be tightened down once you have your anchor in place. My favorite way of setting these up is to figure out where the placement's going to be by first tying your BFK and kind of position where it is and then lay the frame down, connect everything, stand it back up, and then tension down your ratchet straps and then tension your line and then you can adjust these later. Um, but yeah, that, that's pretty much it. Um, some, some of the lines are going to have taller frames, like the, we have an eight foot frame also, this is a six footer, and they might have whoopee slings hanging down from the, the hang bolt instead of going straight to delta quick links. The, the rigging style is exactly the same, just have two whoopee slings like these, going over the bolt, fold it over, and then both ends connected to the pointy end of the delta quick links and then the wide end going to the BFK just like that. Um, and then you can adjust the, the height of where you want your hang point to be. So that's pretty cool. And then the other lines are going to have too much of a distance between the anchor and the hang frame to connect the BFK straight to it. So we're going to have extension whoopee slings and those are whoopee slings with these protective covers on them. And so what we're going to do is there's a pair of them per anchor that need them and you're going to use delta quick links on the master point with the wide end on the rope and then the pointy end two of them to the adjustable end of your whoopee sling so you just set open it wide open and slide this protective sleeve to the pointy end of the deltas at the master point on the bfk and then put the fixed end of these whoopies, which also has a protective sleeve, going up to two oval quick links there, going straight to both of them. And then you're going to do the same thing. This will be there, and you just rig your master point off the two extension whoopie slings. Now, it's very important to keep the adjustable end on the anchor.
anchor side because if you have too big of a loop here, the master point will just slide down and it causes all kinds of problems. Uh, that, that pretty much is it. Uh, everything's pretty basic here. All the anchors are going to look like this. So if you have any questions, feel free to radio me over.